The Papua New Guinea swim team received 21 medals overall, including individual and relay medals, along with lots of personal best times being recorded throughout the competition. Six medals awarded to female swimmers were Rehema Kalate, who received a bronze medal in the 50-meter breaststroke, Brittany Murray, who won silver in the 50-meter backstroke, 200-meter backstroke, and 50-meter butterfly bronze in the 100 meter backstroke and sister and Tia Mare who was awarded a bronze in the 50 meter breaststroke event. It was a great experience for me having the games being not hosted for a while and coming back is just great for our development squad to go out there and experience and have that exposure. So it's been great for everyone. Nine medals were awarded to male swimmers. Elijah Akunai, who received two bronze medals in the 50 and 100 meter butterfly events. Leonard Kalate, who received two silver medals for the 50 meter breaststroke and 200 meter breaststroke and two bronze medals for the 100 meter freestyle and 100 meter breaststroke. Yes, this is my first start for our games. Uh, the games were really fun. We got to see uh, some swimmers from different countries and compete against them. And yeah, most of us got PVs and a few of us medal. Yeah, we're really happy with the uh, results from the games and everything we've experienced from it. Teammate Livingstone Aika got a silver medal in the 50 meter butterfly and two bronze medals in the 50 meter and 100 meter backstroke events. Elijah Akunai, he swam extremely well. Yeah, winning some medals for the country and he's in, for the country in in his individual events and smashing his own PBs, so extremely well by him and the rest of the team members. With the 2019 Pacific Games team yet to be finalized by PNG Swimming Inc., results from the Arafura Games in Darwin, Australia will also be used to make selections for the Pacific Games. Uh, this was like an indicator for the results to come in the Pacific Games and so far so good. And now it's just back to more training before we head off to Pacific Games in June. Coach Rick Vendersent, who praised the swimmers for their outstanding performance, says the competition is complete, but all the athletes are now thinking about their preparations and what they can do now to make improvements in and out of the pool before the next competition. Godwin Eki, National MTV Sports.